Hey guys, first off, just wanted to start out the video by saying sorry about the bad lighting. My halogen lamp went out. It's really bright, gets really hot, really bright. And uh, it's an extremely bright lamp. It makes the lighting in the room really nice uh, for videos and stuff. But right now it's not so much. So um, so it's kind of, it, I have a window right here, but it's pretty much overcast out today. So it, the lighting kind of sucks. Sorry about that. But so yeah, um, just going to do the review, just a quick review today on the um, the 08 Planet Eclipse Distortion Elbow Pads. I got them in black. Um, just wanted to start off the video first by saying, you know, it, it is 2009 now, and I think the people, number one, the, the people that get the 09 stuff every year, the new stuff every year, number one, either they're loaded or they're very spoiled by their parents. But if you're like me and you're making your own money and you're spending your own money on this stuff, on you know your paintball stuff which is very expensive honestly I think the paintball industry it needs to set new standards because you know elbow pads $30 it's a bit expensive paints very expensive you know it, it it's a very expensive hobby but you know you just gotta kinda roll with the punches if you like it if you like paintball enough but so you know it when you're making your own money and you're spending your own money it doesn't hurt to get you know to shave five or ten dollars off the cost of something to get the 08s. Uh, I, I wear 07 invert pants, or they might be 08s, 07 or 08s, and I wear the 07 NV Reds jersey, has no padding in it. Doesn't really matter, I don't really care about padding in a jersey. Um, doesn't really, I've, I've never seen a difference. Uh, you know, with any of my friends' dye jerseys, I've tried them all on. They're not, you know, anything special, and the, I think the Reds jersey looks great. And, uh, you know, to shave five or $10 off the price, getting 08s or 07s, are never a bad thing. The di the only difference could be looks. It doesn't, you know, if unless there's a significant improvement that they made, which elbow pads you can't really do much with, go ahead and buy the 08s if you can shave five or ten dollars off if you need to, because it definitely definitely can add up and it can help you save a lot of money real quick. But getting to the review now, um, first impressions when you try them on, they're a little hard to get on, but that's kind of good. It means you know they stick they stick on really well. Um, very comfortable on the inside of it, uh, no itchiness, no tight uh, cutting off your circulation kind of stuff, no, it's not too loose, um, very breathable material here in the front, uh, almost like a, uh, I'm not sure what kind of material exactly, but this is all like a neoprene type thing up here, nice foam padding in the back, uh, the only real bad thing about them is these right here, I don't know if... Uh, I don't know if my hands are just weird, but these things cut into this little area right here a little much for me. It's a tad uncomfortable, but when you're out on the field, I'm sure you would hardly notice it. Um, so yeah, they, they look great. They feel great. They, you know, I don't really have any problems with them besides this, and that's a minor problem. So that's really the only thing that I had wrong with them was just this little thing. The rest feels great. Uh, I've never tried on a whole lot of elbow pads, but um, you know, since I went to camp and then I, I went back to Splatter Park, I tore up my elbow. I'm not sure you can see that. There's a nice scar there now, and there's still a scab from about a about a, a, a three weeks ago or so. So I, I tore up my elbow about two times. The first time I tore it up at this camp, it was really bad. It it was pretty terrible. I took a dive into Snake, and it absolutely destroyed it. And I wasn't Superman sliding for you know, uh, you know, like three or four weeks after that. And, uh, it, it sucked. It does limit you. Go ahead and spend the money on elbow pads. If you really think you need them, especially as a front man, a back man, not so much a front man will need them. Uh, I never looked into them before, but since I was tearing up my elbow, playing a little more hardcore now, definitely a good investment to make. Uh, and, and, you know, you can't play paintball if you're injured, you can't play paintball the right way, the way you want to play it, the way you, uh, the, the top performance you want to get out of your body if you're injured, you can't do it. So go ahead and, you know, make the investment to protect your body um, and, uh, and keep yourself safe and keep yourself uh, ready to play some good paintball. So, um, you know, leave a comment, uh, send me a message uh, if you got any questions about it, and uh, thanks for watching.